talking about the beats here, I want to talk about a subject that comes to mind, and that is Effie's loyalty to Tariq. Now, I know y'all about to say, wait a minute, hold up, she ain't loyal to Tariq. You're going to go back to the betrayal, but I'm not talking about um, the betrayals that she has done. I'll go right ahead and go through the betrayals real quick before we get into the loyalty. Basically, she betrayed Tariq in book one at the very end, where she got Tariq and Brayden kicked out of Cho. And then she came through with betrayal at the end when she plotted with Kane in season two behind Tariq's back, along with Brayden to get rid of Laurie. And then in season three, where in the end, she told Noma about the plot to get Noma's daughter. And that pretty much was all the betrayals that Effie dominantly did, plus linking up with Kane after they had fallen out. All those are the big betrayals by Effie. However, let's talk about her loyalty. At the end of the day, when it comes down to it, season two Effie, despite the fact that she plotted uh, behind Tariq's back, was the most loyal soldier to Tariq. She was ready to do whatever. She even wanted to take out Kane. She was ready to plot that out, something a lot of people seem to forget. She also was there with Tariq big time. When Tariq was down after he got arrested, she was the one that was there for Tariq. So when it comes down to it, her loyalty to Tariq is something that is crazy. Even in season three, she was loyal to him. The only thing that uh, that caused them to fall apart was him finding out about what happened with Lori. If it was not for that, they would not have fallen apart. However, when it comes down to it to season four, she was loyal to Tariq big time. This is the season that she had Tariq's back big time. In the very beginning, when people were coming to take Tariq out and they were about to get her, even Kane, she texted Tariq to let him know that they were at the school and they were coming for him, even saying that Kane was coming for him. Then not only that, let's talk about the fact that when Tariq told her to let Noma and them know there's some competition on, you know, at the schoolhouse, she pretty much told them that, but found out it was Tariq that was actually the one that was doing the stuff there and that he pretty much had gotten her to use her to get to Kane to take out the people who was in position for him to get in. And when she found that out, she still protected Tariq. And in the end, helped Tariq, got rid of Carter, and now she's the number two in Tariq's organization. Effie's story is a very interesting story because we still don't know enough about her backstory. Her mother suddenly showing up and there's no plot around that. Um, there's also the situation with her now being back with Tariq fully. The fact that she chose not to go on a run with Kane to give him the money that she had for herself to go to school and everything of that nature. Right now, we're in a position where Effie is the number two in Tariq's organization, but will there be a romantic link between these two? Personally, I think there's a potential for that to happen. When you have a romantic relationship with somebody um, and y'all work so closely together, believe it or not, old feelings will rise, especially when you're single and that person is single because right now, Effie does not, she's not around Kane anymore. She's with Tariq, Kane is on the run. Tariq is now fully into the life of business, but Effie is right there with him. And so with that being said, he is also single because he is not continuing his relationship with Diana nor is Lori around and so with that being said these two do have opportunity to be around each other to link up with each other and old feelings can arise however her loyalty to Tariq right now is very high however in the future a lot of fans will question this because of what has happened in the past between these two thinking that Effie could potentially be a weak link to Tariq but at the same time I personally think she's going to choose Tariq over everybody when it comes down to it I think she would be more loyal to Tariq than Brady. I know you're going to say, oh, hell no. Nah. I think she's going to be more loyal to Tariq than she is to Kane. I think she will be the number one soldier that will actually go toe to toe with Diana if she pretty much is angry with Tariq and decides she wants to go at it with Tariq. So when it comes down to it, Effie is in position that she was always was. That loyalty that she had in season two, season three, and now season four, which is the season she's been the most loyal in. Uh, is something that cannot be touched because if you got a soldier like Effie on your side, it is going to be a good thing, a great thing. I've always said that, you know, there's some dangerous couples in power. Tariq and Diana and Tariq and Effie are like neck and neck with one another because they're both extremely dangerous people. So when it comes down to it, the whole situation is Effie's loyalty to Tariq. How do you feel about it? Do you feel as though Tariq cannot trust Effie? Do you feel as though she will eventually turn on him? Or do you feel as though that loyalty or how she was in season four for him will be something that she will be like pretty much like for good like she's definitely going to have his back for good you let me know because i got a feeling that she's going to be Tariq. she's going to be loyal to Tariq, and she's going to really ride a die 
for Tariq. So that's pretty much what I personally feel. But I just wanted to say to all of you that it is your boy Bobby B's here. I just want to say much love, much respect. Hold it down. And oh.